Shalom. Shalom. Hoping this looks great. Okay. It's kind of cold. Alright. Hope you guys can see this face right here. Same person. Same person right here. Okay, there should be a dot right there. Should see a dot above my eyebrow in the picture. Basically, I just want to bring out, I just want to bring out as many scriptures as I can, because time is so precious. We don't know when we're going. You know, we don't know if we're staying. You know what I mean? But basically, uh, I just want to start this off with wisdom, because by wisdom is, you know, is the foundation of a friendship, of uh, anything, of a house. Okay. All right, so let's break it down like this. I'm, I'm just taking this couple for example. Basically, all right, so when you start a relationship with somebody, all right, so wisdom and understanding would start that relationship off with truth, all right? Okay? Now, if you don't got wisdom or understanding, you know, how is that relationship going to, you know, how based off your understanding and your wisdom so let's say uh let's say if this guy was a a, a womanizer all right basically hooked up with women told them everything they wanted to hear so smoothly deceived them and that's just like this truth all right um so salvation is so it's it's so so fragile okay because the thing is we're getting to those times where people don't want to pay mind to you know a poor man and the thing is i want to stress right now you know the importance of you know a wise a poor man you know because there's 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 two types of poor man in this world there's the wise one and there's you know there's the foolish one and uh basically i heard upon the moon you know call yahweh by shimmy i was shy by shimmer kakodash Double honest to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. Peace, blessing, and salutation, protection to the elect and the hopeful elect. And uh, got my Lion of Judah. You guys can't really see it, but uh, but basically, you know, this is what I, this is what I be riding. You know, this I don't got a car. I don't got I don't got you know I don't got bills in my name. But you know, I, I strive for that though. You know. Um. Basically, the thing is, I just want to stress how poor I am right now. Because the thing is, if you guys stick with me, you guys, you guys can see, you know, the prosperity in this thing. You know, how it builds up from ground up. Okay? So wisdom, you know, that's that principal thing we all need to get. And uh, this is Ecolacticus 1. one. I'll start at 4. Wisdom had been created before all things. And the understanding of prudence from everlasting. The word of God most high is the fountain of wisdom. So the thing is, the most high God, he's gotta he's gotta he's gotta give you wisdom, alright? You just can't say, Hey, I woke up, I got you know, I woke up today, I feel like I got wisdom. No, nah, well it's it's the most high that thrusted you down, not man, spoke of in Job. And in her ways are everlasting commandments. To whom have the root of wisdom been revealed? Or who had known her wise counsels? She asked me if I believed in aliens, and that's when she shooed me them. And I, you know, it was she's unpleasantly unlearned. And basically, I still have them in remembrance. Okay, spoke of in Job, and it humbles me because you know I could have died that night. Okay, you know people don't know what the holy angels are, UFOs are, but those secrets these belong to the Most High God and His wisdom forever. You know, and our and his children, his his seed, man, the people he's dealing with, the so the twelve tribes, so called blacks, Mexicans, Latinos, and Native Americans, and uh, you know those are his chosen people. And the thing is, he knows he knows all our enemies before we even know our enemies. Because he, how is that? How do I know that? Is because when you read the scriptures, you start to understand how the mind of the Most High God works, his characteristics, and I mean. I mean, he's 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 very he's very straight to the cut, man. He's very blunt, and the thing is, he's 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 the most fairest. He's the most merciful. He's the greatest of all, man. And people, you know, and we're getting into those times where people ain't trying to pay no mind, but we're in those times where you, you want to pay every 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 time you get because that dime, with that time that you that 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 burning, that's what a burnt offering is. That's righteous sacrifice. All right. 
when when you when you stop to do something good, you're you you're burning your time in a good way, not in a bad way. All right? Um to whom have the root of wisdom been revealed or who have known her wise counsels? And uh this is this is very deep too. There is one wise and greatly to be feared. Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, the Lord sitting upon his throne. He created her and saw her and numbered her and poured her out upon all his works. So, oh, slack it. Hang on, forgive me. She is with all flesh according to his gift, and he hath given her to them that love him. Okay, not everybody loves him, all right? But there's, you know, he's created, he's created special beings of us down here, sent from him. From, from himself, okay? To show us, to show you guys, you know, how much we really love him, man. We're, we're, I, I had a business, y'all, that gave it up, all right? And that's the thing. I was miserable there, all right? I was working for, a, 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 you know, a higher, uh, you know, the government, you know? So that I was working for the government, and the thing is that it just gets, it gets deeper and deeper once you once you go up in the level in the ranks okay higher responsibility you know that's that's it's, it's, it's you get higher responsibility in this thing you know you, you get you get punished you know more and uh the thing is she's unpleasant to the unlearned and uh i just want to bring out a lot of scriptures uh Slovakia. Ecolacticus 119, wisdom reigneth down skill and knowledge of understanding, standing, and exalted them to honor that hold her fast. The root of wisdom is the fear of the Lord, and the branches thereof are a long life. The fear of the Yahweh by Hashem Yahushua, the Lord driveth away all sins. So like he away sins, and where it is present, he turneth away wrath. A fierce man cannot be justified for the sway of his fury shall be his destruction a patient man will tear for a time and afterward joy shall spring up into onto him proverbs 2 and 10 and pull that up real quick um but basically the most high god's about to destroy all these heathens and uh it's time to repent and seek yahweh when wisdom entereth into thy heart and knowledge is pleasant unto thy soul, discretion shall preserve thee and understanding shall keep thee to deliver thee from the way of the evil man, from the man which speaketh forward things, okay? And the thing is, it's, it's, that, it's that mind you're listening to when you wake up in the morning. You a true Israelite, man. Seek your how or repent, man. And that's the thing, to deliver thee from the strange woman. So, all right. It's just like this this evil man and this strange woman, okay? It's like a couple, okay? And all they all they want to do is just pull you out of the way of the most high, all right? So, all right, you know how a beauty of a woman basically a beauty of a woman basically you don't want to get stuck in a be the beauty of a woman because we know that the woman is the beginning of all sin. Let me pull that up. Cause the thing is, you you'd be stuck with a bitch, man, and that that shit would just—I mean, these bitches are weak. Men, men, like when it comes to wisdom and knowledge, they don't know—they don't know better. They don't have the fear of the Most High. Um. But the fear, the flinty rock. If you look at the moon, she's flinty. All right. So basically, I just want to pull up these scriptures, cause wisdom, she's the ultimate thing. Uh, Deuteronomy 32 and 13 He hath made him ride on the high places of the earth That he might eat the increase of the fields And he made him to suck the honey out of the rock And oil out of the flinty rock Wis Matching up with wisdom of Solomon 11 and 4 When they were thirsty They called upon thee And water was given them out of the flinty rock And their thirst was quenched Out of the hard stone So if this isn't telling you that this is the moon right here I mean, you need to repent. And if you can't get that, she talked to me and, you know, I'm adding up scriptures. The thing is, I ain't never stepped in.